Tonight we're looking into the building co codes of an old apartment that burned to the ground last week. The East Brainerd complex was very old and without several critical pieces of technology needed for fighting fires. News Channel 9's Betsy Golden joins us now with more. Betsy. Good evening, Calvin and Latricia. So I spoke with the fire marshal at the Chattanooga Fire Department earlier today, and he said fires aren't, common, aren't more common in older buildings, but they are more devastating when the equipment hasn't been updated. Two critical pieces of equipment weren't updated in the Hidden Creek apartment complex. And this building did not meet the requirements to require a sprinkler system or an additional alarm system to be added. Sprinklers and additional alarms, what would have alerted both residents and fire departments much sooner to the fire that quickly devastated the building. Fire Marshal William Matlock says apartments are inspected each year to make sure they're up to code and that codes are updated about every four years. But those updates usually only apply to new construction. The standard continues to change and unfortunately a lot of times when the code change it's due to an incident. He did not know the last time Hidden Creek had been inspected, but said it did have recently serviced fire extinguishers. There were fire extinguishers in place, but again, the lack of early notification, I think, hindered this so that by the time everyone was alerted to the situation, the fire, the fire was too big for the fire extinguishers to, to do their job. Twelve families were displaced from the fire, and several of the renters were without insurance. This is something that Vicki Champion, the owner of North Shore Insurance, says is common. She strongly recommends people get renter's insurance and that many times people can get it for as little as $12 a month. There are um, four basic parts to a renter's policy. You get guaranteed replacement for all of your personal property. You get loss of use, you get personal liability, and you get med pay. She said, is it you're the, the mercy of the apartment next door to you? The person there, they may be smoking, um, be using a grill indoors, um, they may leave oil on the stove, a candle burning. And right now the cause of the fire is still under investigation, but you can see what you're looking at is just how bad the destruction was. You can see washers and dryers and, and articles of clothing that have been left behind. Now I just spoke with one of the construction members who is working on cleaning up and he says this rain is really going to affect how long it takes them to clean it up. But again, this fire is still under investigation. Reporting live, Betsy Golden, News Channel 9. Thanks, Betsy.